Alright, so here we go. This is Damned by Nighthead Studio. I'm the Urban Watcher, and my YouTube channel is The Zombie Professor. Okay, so it looks like I started off as a survivor. Uh, you know, and I do like, I like the camera fuzziness and when people start walking in front of you in the game. Okay, so this... Oh yeah, see, that looks a lot better. Okay, this is a game by uh, Nine Hit Studio. They're a Brazilian developer. And they, this is an early alpha. Uh, the premise of the game, in case you don't, uh, you don't know, is that you are uh, one of four survivors that are walking, uh, locked in an environment with a supernatural force trying to, um, trying to get you, trying to kill you. So it's a fundamental giant adult version of hide and seek, and uh, it's very much in the in the the uh, spirit of Outlast, Amnesia, or Slender. If any of you have ever played those games. Now I'm hoping to encounter the uh, the creature here. Now, one of the players in the game, let's see, I'm, sure, I'm, I'm tabbing so you can see, uh, Narcomalonian is the monster, and so this is a unique feature in that a lot of the power is given over to another player, so it, they could be either very, 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 very good, or very, 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 very bad. And the game is beat the game is beatable each session. Uh, we've actually had members in our group uh, win the game because of one of our monsters was horrible, and then every time I'm a monster, I'm pretty bad at it. So, <laughs> now, nah, yeah, yeah, laugh at me with Mr. Flurf. Uh, uh, uh oh, someone died. So that means that somebody, the monster, is in physical form. So we should despawn any second. So I'm gonna try to find out where that body went. So that I can go steal the keys, because the uh, the creature uh, only has a certain amount of time. Uh oh! Ooh, someone just died. The creature only has a certain amount of time before. Oh shit! Uh, <laughs> before he has to go into his uh, spiritual form. The creature should be dead, and I'm out of spring. Oh my god! I hear the music! I don't like the music! The music is creeping me out. So I picked up a bunch of keys. I need to get out of dodge and hide somewhere. Uh, it's just a matter of time before the creature spots. And I need to get out of here. I need to find a hiding spot. Quickly. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> the music popped and I'm actually really kind of freaked out here. I noticed that is if you stay in a satellite room next to the hallways, you're more likely to be caught by the creature. Whereas if you go off to one of the rooms that are a little bit further away and close the doors around you, user uh, left your channel. You're you're less likely to be caught by uh, the actual creature. My bad luck would be if the creature pops in the room that I started off with. So what I'm gonna do is uh, I'm gonna wait. See. The survivors that were with me uh, left a lot of the. I, I, it's exactly what I thought. We were all in a hurry to get out of the room that not everybody searched it correctly. So, you know, if this is a game that you're interested in getting, it is a, an alpha. It's in rough. Uh, it's a rough development right now, but the the developers are working pretty hard. I actually emailed one of them and got a response to be able to use their footage on YouTube. And uh, they're a nice group of guys. I mean, they're they've gotten very little press out there by the mainstream public and this is a game that it, it I, I am calling it right now you know I quote me today is the 28th of September this game is it, if they do it right this is going to be the next big left for dead type of game it's a it's a game that fills uh, fills a, a need you know uh, there's you know for people that want to play horror survival games or uh, any horror horror co-op game shit Oh crap. Okay, you hear that scratching? That means the monster is on the other side of that door. So I'm not opening the door. 
I'm gonna sit here instead and I'm gonna hide, turn off my light. So that means that the that the uh, the monster spawned. I'm waiting for him to go despawn, and I'm gonna switch locations. I've got a couple of the keys, so it's my responsibility to try to open some of these doors. I've got. Oh sh! That was by f one of the traps that the monsters set, so the monsters know that at least I, I uh, close the door behind me. Hopefully the monster does not spawn in here. I hear my fellow survivors walking around, and I'm pretty good at finding the keys, so I'm searching all the... Uh-oh. So the guy with the crowbar is knocking on the doors, and he died, so that means that there is... the monster is in physical form, and I have closed the door around me. Hopefully he doesn't know that he could actually get in here if he wanted to. So I'm going to try to be as quiet as possible. I'm going to try to wait till he pops back into ghost form before I move into the hallway. Uh, the, the hallway is really one of the biggest places where you can get caught out in this game. So I'm looking through the... in here, and I think I might be the only one alive right now.